Hey, Tax Bros. We often get the question on what tax solution is right for me as you look into our Intuit and tax products. So we got to sit down with our client, Mark Berger in Austin, Texas, and he shares his perspective on our three tax products here with Intuit on this edition of Tax Pro Talk or hashtag TPT. Where I want to get started in the show today is no one knows who you are except for Jim and I. Right. Outside here. So okay. tell everybody a little bit about you, Mark, your firm, and kind of what's the purpose? What are you guys striving to do here? Got it. Cool. Thanks. Uh, you know, we are, we're a little small firm, Wimberley, Texas, here between San Antonio and Austin. Um, you know, we started as, a, started as a traditional tax and business consulting firm. And the more and more we leaned on into it, QBO and all that stuff, all the technologies coming out right now that's kind of flipping the accounting industry on its head. Yeah. We're just, um, you know, we're doing that to kind of re reinvent ourselves a little bit, really helping clients uh, move their their businesses into the future. And, um, you know, it's an exciting time. Yeah, so, yeah, absolutely. It sure is. And, and we were just talking over lunch and learning a little more about you and the firm. And one of the interesting things that we found out about Mark is he's actually... You've used Pro Series, correct? Yeah. You've used LaCert. Yep. And there's some interest in our tax online now. Yeah. So you're kind of mm -hmm. spanning the globe across all three. So I want to talk a little bit yeah. about that, if you don't mind. For sure. Perfect. So how did you get started with Pro Series? That was the first product you used, mm -hmm. correct? Right. Yep. When I started with my partner Terry, um, he was using Pro Series. It was 15, 16 years ago, and it was a good product for a long time. But we kind of got to a point where uh, we felt like we needed a little bit more. So we stuck with Intuit and they had LaCert. And so we okay. moved up the ladder a little bit. Intuit has produced a great product in LaCert for us. It's an awesome tax, it, a tax software. It's made us better tax professionals. And now as we continually move towards the cloud, we really feel like we got to start setting our sights on ProConnect. Like we got to be able to move it to the next level again into the cloud. So, so yeah. you, there's a there's a lot of stuff in there. So I'm gonna dig in just sure. a little bit, right? So when you started on Pro Series and with your practice, what what was your practice like at that time? Clientele, mm -hmm. the work you guys were doing and why Pro Series? What what did you right. like about it? Why did it fit in? Yeah, for me, Pro Series was a default. I didn't make that decision. Like I said, it's what my partner was using and uh, it worked well. It's how I learned to do tax prep. And okay. so it's where I started. So for me, that was just uh, an accepted practice, right? So started there, it worked really well. And, um, you know, so that's kind of how we started with Pro Series. Okay. Mm -hmm. Perfect. And then you said earlier that you guys grew and needed a little more, right? So it turned to looking at LaCert, the mm -hmm. product we had there. Mm -hmm. What was the little more you were looking for? Was, was the firm growing? What, what yeah. made you guys? Yeah, it was just a more robust um, platform. You know, we were seeing some limitations with the number of returns. We were doing some update stuff and we, uh, had a couple of minor glitches and the software kind of guys at, at Pro Sears were like, ah, we think you might be needing to go to, you know, we were wanting to do a network version. We were going to multiple locations and it was just kind of the support was saying, hey, you might need to look at the cert now. And so, um, you know, so it was an easy transition. They walked us through the migration, transferred all our client files and we hit the ground running. So it's been really good. Fantastic. Yeah. And how long have you been with the cert now? Um, I think this will be our third year with LaSur. Okay. So yeah, third or fourth year. But okay. Yeah, so not very long. Still yeah. in that transition. And yeah, we we moved pretty quickly. We okay. were we you know they there was some question about should we be migrating on both sides a little bit on Pro Series and move slowly. We just kind of jumped in and said, let's get migrated over and we moved to LaSur. We haven't missed a beat. Yeah. So fantastic. Yeah. And, and what's the total number of clients you're doing in LaSur? I'm sure people are curious. Sure. Yeah. So I don't know number of clients is hard to say because many of our clients have multiple entities. Okay. So we'll have a 1040 and 21120 S's in a partnership or something. And then, you know, but um, sure. number of return wise, we're doing close to 2000 returns, I wow. think. So almost 2000 returns. And how, and we probably should address this earlier. So it's on me, but what's the staff size for you in the firm here? If you're doing that volume, it can't right. just be you. Right. Yeah. Hopefully no, not. of course not. No, <laughs> no way. That'd be impossible. Um, so we're about 20 staff um, total uh, growing, you know, so uh, we're somewhere between 18 and 22 staff total, probably on the production team, on the people that are actually pumping out returns. It's 15, 16, 17 people. And um, so, yeah. We're going to get into this next phase, especially it's 
kind of a, a new transition for the industry, for our profession yeah, of cloud sure. and leaning into cloud. And mm -hmm. you've done a lot of leaning into on the QB side, mm -hmm. which we'll touch base on that here in a minute. Okay. But as we as you look into the next transition of your firm, especially on the tax side, there's some inquiry into our tax online mm -hmm. software. So where are you in that evaluation phase? Sure. Can you lean in just a little bit about what's what's really spurring that? For another change in tax software. Sure. You know, I just I just want to make sure we're being really forward thinking as a firm. So I'm saying, hey, it looks like everything's going to the cloud. Apps are how everybody's operating everything, it seems like. And so we just see that as the natural transition, right? We're gonna get away from a from a installed software on a server that we gotta maintain and spend thousands of dollars to upkeep and maintain every year. And we want to push that burden onto Intuit and push onto ProConnect, right? Frankly, sure. so if you guys can do it better, bigger, faster, and have the system to do it, we we need to focus on serving our clients and learning complex tax code, and uh, helping our clients, you know, grow their businesses. You know, so that's really the interest and just the full integration of it all, right? If I can take a client and I can have them in the mm -hmm. cloud and QBO, and I can from there, sync that data and push it into ProConnect someday and have some synergy there and really build some efficiencies that allows me to spend, again, more of my time on my client, servicing them, helping them grow the business. That's that's a win-win for everybody. All right, what a great interview we had with Mark, Jim. That was a great time to be down there. And I wanna just kind of sum up a few things. When he talks about Pro Series, what we learned from Mark and tax pros all across the country as we visit with them is pro series being that forms based we see a lot of enrolled agents that's where they learn that's where they start um it's a very robust program most that we offer program yeah, out there in the market. absolutely most popular one that we have and it's a great solution to get started just like mark and his firm did as he's growing his practice getting set up and then his clients he evolved and they kind of became more complex he moved into lacert yep and mark likes lacert because it has uh, more integrated forms, more diagnostics can be uh, a little bit more robust when he's got uh, high volume of returns and multi office like he has um, and multi staff. So a little bit more workflow built in there, more filtering uh, workflow tools to kind of help manage that heavy workload as you know, their office has grown to 20 in a couple of locations. Yep. And, his, and I love his next progression talking about our newest solution, ProConnect Tax Online, and migrating as we talk about an industry and moving to the cloud and the benefits of expanding yeah. to where his staff doesn't need to be here in yeah. Texas with them. He can exactly right. cross borders, cross state lines, and, and pull clients from multiple locations. And then the benefit of not having servers and installing software, really right. about the benefits of being online and being in the cloud yep. with ProConnect Tax Online and what that solution can deliver as well. So if you're considering or thinking about what solution's right for you, Mark offers great advice. If you need help from us, let us know. Jim and I are here to help talk through that. We appreciate you tuning in to this edition of Tax Pro Talk. We'll see you next time right here on Hashtag TBT. TBT.